Welcome back now at 530 Women's Health Headlines, where we focus on health stories that are specifically impacting women and a common issue for women could have a relatively simple fix. About three in four women have a condition called uterine fibroids. It's a collection of tissue in the uterus that could cause some potentially debilitating symptoms that impact daily life. Issues from fibroids impact about a third of women who have them. And to find out more about what women can do, we are talking with Dr. Michael Hallisey, a radiologist at Jefferson Radiology. Dr. Hallisey, thanks so much for being with us. Thank you, Erin. Good afternoon. Good afternoon to you. So for anyone watching tonight, what are the typical symptoms of fibroids? What should we be looking out for? Well, as fibroids grow, they cause two different categories of symptoms. One is heavy bleeding because the fibroids bring a lot of blood into the uterus. The other set of symptoms is that the fibroids grow and they can become very large. They can cause pelvic pain or pressure on the urinary bladder, causing frequent urination. If someone's experiencing these symptoms, what do you feel, doctor, the best solutions to treat uterine fibroids? Well, women should seek out and inform themselves of all the treatments that are available. Some women seek out a hysterectomy, which is the complete removal of the uterus. But we want patients to be aware of their options and all their options. Some women will want to seek a less invasive option. And at Jefferson Radiology, we offer something called uterine fibroid embolization, or UFE. It's a big word, but it's a simple procedure. And doctor, what's the biggest thing you'd like our viewers to take away from this entire discussion on uterine fibroids? Well, the, the UFE, or uterine fibroid embolization, is an outpatient procedure, and it's one that's viable for patients. I want them to know that they have options for their symptoms. They should explore everything and they can get more information at jeffersonradiology.com. All right, definitely a good resource. Dr. Michael Hallisey, thank you so much for all of that good information and advice. We appreciate it.